dun 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 When you know that Katie's woken up, it's time for the Darth Vader mug today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Look, the Keurig kind of makes it... <laughs> really? Really? <laughs> That's what's happening behind the scenes. Let Darth Vader be great. This mug actually reminds me of Tomorrowland. I because see you I... have constructed a new mug. Coffee mug. <laughs> Hashtag Adam. <laughs> <laughs> I would I would give so much money to hear him say the lightsaber thing right now <laughs> to make me laugh. But this really reminds me of Tomorrowland because I got this in Star Trader um, probably like what four years ago. And so every time I drink out of this mug, I don't even think of Star Wars. I think of uh, Star Trader. Oh, yeah. It really, it makes me want to live my best Star Trader life, but I can't right now. I'm going to get my oat milk. Would you uh, get me oat milk out of the fridge? Yeah. Well, good morning, everyone. Day three for us. Thank you for my oat milk. Oatly. Oatly. The boring side? Oh, that's it. Well, it just means it's the boring side because it says all of the, like, you know, nutrition information and, like, how to store it. Oh, that's Shamrock's from yesterday. But now it's time for breakfast in the normal <laughs> world. Sorry. <laughs> Patrick, it will be back next year. Uh, oh. Really? Italian soda. Thank you. We had mm. this last night. This stuff's so good. We're having it again today. Just guzzle this stuff. Oh it's my gosh. It's so good. Yeah. It's like perfect for breakfast. Oh no, too. empty bottle. Scary. Uh, <laughs> I know, right? So you made, are, what kind of pancakes are these? Um, just regular pancakes from cool. a mix. Cool, cool. Yeah, and then... Um, potatoes from last night. Potatoes, and that's, they're so good the next day. Oh, I bet. And, <laughs> and then, then a, I just put some fruit together. Fruit wee. That's how you yeah. say it in French. Fruit wee. Oh, really? I didn't know that. Yeah. All right. Breakfast time. What happened to the mask? washed it off. Okay, good. Alright, I'm gonna put you some down. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Two or three? Uh, Start with two. Just give me three, because... You know what's gonna I, happen. <laughs> I think I'll have three also, then. All right. Just go that way. I burned this last one, so I'll have the burn, because I actually like the taste of burn. Feel the burn, Katie! Feel the burn! <laughs> Remember when people used to say, Burn! I don't know if your generation did that. No. But my generation, if you, you know, got somebody, you know, jokingly, obviously, with your friends. Oh, yeah. Wait. Like, burn! And I, like, cooked these in actual butter. I can tell because my favorite thing is these ridges. Yeah, they're when not my, very crispy when my grandma anymore. Used to, when my grandma used to make me buckwheat cakes, mm -hmm. she would cook them in the bacon grease, and then it would get those edges like that. Oh, so yeah, you're not going to get that today, obviously, because we've been talking, so I'm sorry. The edges are there. What are you talking about? No, but they're not going to be crispy once yes, they sit they for a are. minute. No, it's... they're always crispy. Calm yourself. Okay. Oh. Calm yourself. <laughs> no potatoes for you. Oh. What? I'm just kidding. Yeah, I was gonna say, you just dump the whole bowl. Yep. Thank you. Oh, gosh. Here you go. Thanks. It's gonna be freezing by the time we eat it, but oh well. It's like Disneyland. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say at Disneyland. It's like when we get breakfast at Disneyland and we want to go sit in a different area or something, and we'll take the whole tray somewhere. And it'll be morning time, and by the time we sit down, and get napkins and get all our stuff oh. and pour cream in the coffee. Mm -hmm. It's cold, but it still tastes good. So the edges are crispy. Okay, we made it down. Got a little breezy, but it's still, the sun is still very warm. There's the jacuzzi I was telling you guys about. It's even more exposed now that the tide has gone down further. So we can show it to you. Get a sense of the size. I mean, look at that thing. That is cozy. Two people get sitting there. It's really cool for one. You can really get super chill and relaxed. Although it's so windy right now, the wind is very cold. There's no way I'm getting in there right now because you can probably hear the wind in the camera. 
we were sitting up in our normal spot up there, but we had to come down and take shelter under the apartment right here. Because uh, this it's kind of a wind block, this building right here, thank goodness. So we'll be able to hang for a little bit longer. That umbrella too, <laughs> took a dive at one point. Pinky needs her shade, so Katie's setting up the umbrella. But you probably can't hear the wind here. It's like a noticeable difference. So great. She's chilling. Kind of watching the reef right here. It'll be harder to see whales now because the surface is so disturbed, but it's beautiful out at least. Oh. Okay, so we're situated comfortable in the new spot. Super warm. Oh yeah. I can see the wind, but I can't feel it. Oh yeah. I'm sure people are wondering like, current state of maybe like emotion or whatever i'm kind of in the mode of like i've accepted and i'm just i'm just kind of like uh trying to make the best of it well yeah find find all these things that now that life has changed a full 180 it's like okay so what do we do with this and so obviously a lot more beach time which we're enjoying and uh we're thinking of other things and so i'm in that mode of like kind of creating ideas and, and things uh, for this new future that we live in right now. Um, what about you, Katie? How do you feel? Like, I'm kind of, in a way, I feel like it's nice to take a break from everything, and maybe it's a good thing. I'm just trying to, like, as much as things make me sad, like, I really do miss going to Disneyland, like, the little things that you don't think about, like, just walking down Main Street, just sitting there at Jolly Holiday, listening to the music, watching the people go by. That stuff I miss like immensely. I miss seeing our friends, but at the same time, it's like, it's nice to spend time together. It's forced us to, you know, get creative and take a break and sleep in. And, you know, I think it's better for us as a channel and like a, you know, best life and beyond family that like we can kind of like get to know each other more and talk more and like focus on like at least you guys will get to know us a little bit better, I feel like. So, while looking at the positives, that's definitely one, um, you know, and it's hard to take away all this anxiety because, I mean, man, not knowing stuff and, and it's like a silent thing that, a silent invisible thing that is threatening so much and so many and that's what's really scary. But. We're staying positive and I'm just really thankful that we have YouTube so we can all stay connected. Alright, we, we've adjusted our position yet again. Gotta be fluid in these type of uh, conditions with the wind. Very true. Optimizing our situation. friend Miles. Look at, he always carries two tennis balls in his mouth. Sometimes three. Sometimes three, yeah. I've seen three. You're right. Three has he can't get enough. Look at him. He's come to say hello to Binky and Katie. How you doing, dude? Binky's on safari again. Uh, she's been in the shade. We, you know, we always provide shade for her. And she... She loves the beach, so... Oh, there's your seagull Oh, seagulls. Look at these two. Nap time. Afternoon nap time. Post beach nappers. Binky, are you cozy enough? And Katie's out like a light. As the sun sets on another day another here. Quarantine day. Another quarantine day here. In the kingdom.
in the kingdom. <laughs> I've planned our dinner. I feel like all y'all are seeing today is our uh, beach meal, beach meal, beach meal. Well, but that's the reality. We're trying to be vigilant, man. This is us. This is us locking down, and so being responsible Americans. As boring as we are, I know it's not like we're. You know what? I, you know what I want to do though tonight is um, I wanted to because I've really been missing Disneyland. I yeah. think after we eat dinner, I think we should look at because I have my cork board and let's oh just yeah, pull out well some of our memorabilia. That's a good idea because we're gonna start cleaning out that room anyways. So let's so do it and just kind of look. Yeah, we should pull out a few things just to start taking inventory in there and get that process yeah. started. For dinner tonight, we're gonna do a pizza. I froze our casserole. Oh. Um, so it made two more servings we still have, so ah, good. we'll just thaw this out if we ever want it. And, um, you know, it's got protein, it's got everything in it we need. Sweet. And then tonight, because we were craving something different, we're going to do um, some greens. I got a little bit of this dinosaur kale I just roughly chopped. I did some of the asparagus and some uh, spinach. Not all of the spinach, just a handful. We'll put that together with lemon and garlic. Dinosaur kale, I'm intrigued. Well, it's like lasted canine, I'll just lie, I can't say the word. And then I found some Parmesan and Cheddar Jack. It's okay. just what we have. Um, and then we had this. I had opened it. It's some garlic marinara pasta sauce. Cool. So, again, it's kind of like using what we have. And then we had this. This was like what? two dollars or a dollar hey it's an original pizza crust so there it is we're preheating the oven right now and we're making a fabulous pizza pie in the oven of a that's it you know this was from breakfast so oh yeah you know I'm down got all kinds of my hands are clean by the way oh, what, so yeah oh what what is thanks. that what is that <laughs> Katie's prepping her pizza. She's getting the dough ready, and she. Na, 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 na. I just handmade this. Oh I just gosh. tossed it, shaped it. I don't think it's necessary to have to spin it because it's already pre-made. But you can... It's not. I just made it. I okay. don't know what you're talking about. I mixed the dough. I needed it. Is needed a word? I need it. I need it. I needed it. But I, then, I, I just need it to be cooked instead of played with. Uh, no, 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 you okay. missed the whole th show. It was okay. like freaking Lady and the Tramp up in here. Oh boy. Na, 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 na. Please don't drop that. Oh, you don't want to go for a ride? Yeah. <laughs> here we go. Next stop, Pizza Town. Oh, gosh. Hey, Spence, catch. <laughs> I really didn't want to go on the teacups again, but dang it, Spence. I don't want to spin! I don't want to... No! And the pièce de résistance for the pizza play party. This is what happens. Yes! Yes! Move the camera. Tick! Tuck. Tuck. Tick. Tick. Tuck. Tuck. Does it really look like him? It does to me. Here's for reference. Here's yeah. the magnet that we keep on the refrigerator. Yeah, it's close, close enough, you know. I think it's not bad. Yeah. That concludes this edition of Playing With Your Food. We'll see you next time. Well, Katie makes uh, starts on the pizza over there. Are you hey! Gonna, are you gonna unload the dishwasher? Oh, I gotta go get the... Uh, by the way, I the, do wanna know... I have you, to get the rest of the laundry, actually. By the way, I do wanna note you did do um, the dishwasher last night. I, I realized in the video, I was like, I hope... Oh, yeah. It looked like you ran away from me, but you did, in fact, do... Oh yeah, so that everybody knows. But tonight you need to do. I, I gotta go get the. I gotta go get the laundry though, okay, first and foremost. But really quick, I just wanted to show everybody above the sink because sometimes you see in the background of the shots all this stuff up here. Well, there's a few pops, a few things um, up on top. Ty Webb pop from uh, Caddyshack. That's from Charlie, my buddy Charlie, Pixar Charlie, as you guys know him. And I miss Pixar Charlie so much. And then there's one of my Conans as Iron Man, Chris Hardwick. One of them is mine. I and think then, mine is the Iron Man. Yeah, there's two Iron Mans up there. No, one Spider Man. That was from last year's Conan Con at Comic Con. But I got I have two Chris Hardwicks because one is uh, the blood splattered version and signed, and then one is uh, the, the stock one. This is a mug from Pete Holmes, uh, Pete Holmes show. That was our wrap gift. Pete made these for us. Everybody on the crew got their own mug with their name on it. Like it, that was the logo for the Pete Holmes show. So, so sweet. He made those for us. And there's Surfer Santa from uh, Victor and Megan. Uh, he chills all the time just because he's a Surfer Santa and we live on the beach. Uh, this is a like a marquee sign S that I don't know where like, they had that for 35 years. Um, there's a Porg. There's a thermal detonator. 
And there's a bunch of exclusive Haunted Mansion Tiki mugs. Meaning uh, that I kind of never finished, but we just threw it up anyways, because whatever. And then the fridge, the fridge has all sorts of magnets. Is a huge, this is a huge magnet from the final finale of American Idol, like the actual final one that we did for Fox. All right, the vegetables are done. That's a quarantine salad right there, cooked. And Mr. Pizza is done. Look how good this looks. But you know what? We are going to go live. So Spence is gonna, look at how sweet he is. He did my laundry. Thank you. Uh -huh. um, and we're gonna just do live and eat our pizza and talk and do a quick check-in with everybody. And um, yeah, so time to eat. I'm starving though. <laughs> All right, because we're missing Disneyland so much, I grabbed our two pieces of churro coffee. Let's only eat one. We're only eating one. Okay. Um, but we've kept it like in a, a Ziploc. Bite. Literally, yeah. I could just eat a bite. I kept it in a Ziploc bag, but we're gonna have a bite and we're gonna look at some Disney memorabilia. Oh. Just because. Um, here's your piece. Thank you. Cheers. So good. Wow. That was incredible. Speaking of churro, do you remember when we got that? We're from the diamond celebration. These were the only three pins that I could get. I'm really sad that I didn't get more. Also got these, well, I don't remember when those came out, but these were all I could get my hands on. I think I missed a few, um, but I loved them. I just thought this was such a fun collection. I needed to stop collecting pins, by the way. Uh, this is an old uh, Life Disney button sticker we got from the parks. Um, this is from when I did Livestream Periscope. They sent me, uh, from Twitter, they sent me stickers and fun stuff, and I kept those stickers. Food and Wine last year. Club 33 Coaster. Anniversary of the Enchanted Tiki Room. We got a uh, Wednesday, June 5th for Galaxy's Edge. What else do we have here? Oh, this came with my Beauty and the Beast digital movie. Jackie. This was a series I collected, all the teacups, and I even got the chaser. Uh, this was the Mardi Gras pin set. There's the chaser. The stopwatch collection. Um, these were some I just like traded for in the parks and that were like given to me. This one I purchased from the park. I just loved it. And then this is a 60th. It's kind of a diamond. It's like raised. Uh, Tomorrowland, this was given to me, and it's uh, Jiminy Cricket and his conscience. These were given to me from Paparazzi Mike. These we collected in the blind bags on uh, What's Happening Wednesday. Sadly, we never finished the collection. Spencer got me this one. Um, you also got me the Phantasmic Jumbo. Oh, here's the one you got me. The Phantasmic Jumbo. Oh, you pulled it out of the box. Yeah, I forgot I did. I thought I was gonna keep it in the box. Nurse's Day from 2016. Wow. The only park ears I mostly wear are from Karen, and this is her button. So if you ever wanna find good ears, DZNY girl ears, Mickey's birthday, some Jeff Granito uh, pins from Food and Wine Festival. Oh, look it, we have some Galaxy's Edge pins I haven't even pinned on. And then this is a Club 33 ornament I got one of the times I went. And there's the actual exit, what it looks like when you That's leave. So and then these are some old recipe cards we got for AP days. I remember that. There's a, a homemade surf sticker. That's Spencer's. There's a compact from 33. Um, this was one of my favorite necklaces, but the thing broke off. Mickey's 90th. I mean, pretty cool. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, surf sticker. We kind of he fell down. That's right. He's like, I don't know how to do Tell this. Me. I'm a sticker. I know. He's like, I don't know how to do this. All right, guys. Well, there you go. There's some collection. You can tell we got a little bit of sun. <laughs> Raccoon much? Yeah, I didn't. Well, I used a very low SPF. I didn't realize it out I of didn't habit. Use any? Because I haven't been in the sun in so long. I forgot. I mean, you're just out of habit. Yeah. Um, I'm still eating more churro toffee. Sorry mm. about it. Uh, we are going to wrap that up for tonight. Yep. 
Hope you guys had a good day. Home is where the vlog is three uh, in the books. Uh, tomorrow Hope. in the morning we're gonna do something fun. So oh. make sure you subscribe. Yeah, and hit tomorrow the notifications. Morning's gonna be a blast. Um, yeah, we got something planned. If you like this video, let us know by giving us a thumbs up. I'm gonna put all the information if you want to support our channel and be a Patreon member in the description box below. But don't forget to subscribe. That is correct, and we will see you next time on Best Life and Beyond. Bye bye, everybody. Bye.